Hey Roadrunners, we're going to talk about changing D2L notifications and email forwarding settings. To start, go to your student portal, click on Course Access, and then enter your D2L portal. Once you're in your portal, click in the top right corner for your profile and select Notifications. In this area, you'll see an option for the Pulse app, which is a mobile application where you can get all of your notifications. There are some other methods for doing this as well that don't require an application. You'll see that your default contact method should be your MCC student email account. We recommend leaving this because we're going to show you how to forward your email to a personal address later in this tutorial. It's important to use your MCC student email address for all communications with staff and faculty outside of your D2L portal, as this is the most secure way to keep your information private. You'll also notice that you can register your mobile phone number here for notifications below. You can opt in for a summary of activity daily or weekly for all of your D2L courses, but the instant notifications area is really where the magic is. In this section, you can checkmark SMS, which is texting, or email for a variety of options that you would like to receive notifications with. This can include announcements for changes in class or a WebEx link. This could include assignment due dates approaching, grades, tests upcoming, quizzes, discussions, and more. Take some time to really explore these options and opt in for as many or as few notifications as you would like. You can change this at any time. Another important thing is in the Customize Notifications area, make sure to checkmark Allow Future Courses to send me notifications so that in future semesters, you continue to get these notifications. You can also click Manage My Course Exclusions and remove any courses that you don't want to be included in these notification settings. Make sure to click Save when you're done. Our next step is to click in the top right corner of your profile again and select Account Settings. Next, select Email. Now, as you may know, with any D2L or online course, you have an internal email account just for emailing students and your teacher for that class. This eliminates some confusion with the many students you may interact with in your online classes. We recommend to send emails directly through this portal, even if you're getting notifications elsewhere. If you scroll down to the Forwarding Options section and checkmark the box Forward Incoming Messages to an alternate email account, you'll see that your student email is automatically populated. Again, we recommend leaving this option as we'll show you how to forward emails from your MCC student email account to another account. Select another option below. I recommend forward and mark red in the inbox folder. This leaves a record of your emails in both the D2L email portal as well as your MCC student email portal. When you're done, select save and close. Awesome, so last step. Come back to your MCC student portal and select one of the two student email icons. Select the settings cog in the top right corner of the page. Scroll to the bottom and select view all Outlook settings. Look for an option for forwarding and select enable forwarding. In this area, you can enter a personal email address to forward all your notifications to. I also recommend checking keep a copy of forward messages. This creates one unified place for all your D2L notifications, as well as notifications from MCC staff and faculty about registration, billing, and more. All of these emails will then be forwarded to your personal email address.